Welcome to another episode of The Crazy Fisherman. Today I'm fishing in Selsey. Selsey is signposted from the A286 and B2145 junctions on the A27 south of Chichester. Drive through Selsey High Street and look for any of the beaches. There is plenty of free parking in and around the area. Please like, subscribe and share the channel. There are two fishing tackle shops in the area for baits. One is called Raycrafts in Selsey High Street and the other one is Southern Angling Specialists in Stockbridge which is only a few miles up the road. Okay, I arrived on East Beach. It's not raining and the time is 8.28, so I've got about half an hour or so of daylight left. And here's my setup. One's a, a Fertix rod with a Shakespeare agility reel. 
Uh, okay, 30 pound braid with a leader, 50 pound leader. And the first one going out is on a two hook clipper, like so. And that's one that's only going out a short way. And the other one is on a panel, four ounce lead, and that's my distance one. I put a uh, moon glow, um, what are they called? They attract in, in, the, in the water. I can't think the exact term at the moment. And this one again is on another Vertex Gamma LE420 model with a Vertex reel. Uh, again, 30 pound braid, 50 pound leader. And this is my base camp for the night. Here we are. Right, let's go and put some bait on and uh, see if there's anything out there yet. It's not high tide yet until gone to 2 a.m. But I'll just persevere until then. I'll do a couple of hours after high tide, then I'll pack up. Okay, here we are. That's the best bait that I have to get up that little tree. And that's uh, on the uh, two hook bracket, so I'm just going to cast that one out now. And this is the uh, one on the panel. Uh, it's a bluey, again with black lug, uh, kept together by a bit of elastic. So let's cast this one out now. Here we are, we've got two other fishermen to my right. Looks like they're here for the night as well. So, uh, I haven't seen and caught anything yet. They were here before me. So let's just pan around. You can just make out the lights in the distance where Bogner Regis is. And behind me is the beach houses well not quite because there's a sea wall covering them but anybody who lives down here would definitely know why I am straight away and now I just need to watch my rod tips It's getting a bit dark now, so I'm going to put these um, indicator lights on the tips of my rods. So I've got one blue and this one looks like a pink, so I'm going to put them on now, so I'll make it easier to see, because my eyesight is not as good as it used to be. It's uh, now 10.48, just missed a big take, it was massive, uh, but it came off, I can't believe my bad luck there, but still fine, um, it's, it's nowhere near high tide yet, and uh, I'm just drinking my coffee and uh, keep myself awake, so let's keep trying.
So here I am, um, the second attempt at Celsius. Now it's daytime. It's now 8.44 a.m. High tide is at 11 a.m. I'm glad to say conditions are much better today because it's been right miserable month this May. Anyway, I'm setting up. I'm going to put my first rod out and I'm putting a, a wishbone rig on with uh, green and black beads and five ounce lead. So I'm going to put this one out first and uh, see how it goes. It's 9.15 now, I put out my uh, first two rods and one's a wishbone rig and one is a panel rig. I've got a bit of black lug on the wishbone tipped with a bit of squid. There's no weed down here. Um, what's today? Today is Tuesday and uh, like I say high tide is at 11. It's actually better conditions than what, what I thought. I was going to try West Beach, but West Beach is a bit blowy and a bit choppy there. So I thought I'd give that a miss this time around. So let's we'll see how we go here. Anyway, let's see what happens. Okay, here's my bait I'm using today. I've um, already made up some bait here and I've put them in cling film. I've got one in here. Oh, I've got a couple in here already tied up ready to go straight onto the hook and uh, put these on the hook and put more elastic around to keep them on the hook I've also got a bit of cut up squid a few shrimp prawns I should say and some black lug um, that's for if conditions calm down I can't see conditions calming down out here because I already noticed there's a lot of weed plenty of weed out there Anyway, that's my bait I'm using. Like I said, I prepare it before I come here. Tie it all up so I've got about 12 there. That should do for this session. And that's it. Right, um, 10.48, still no fish, not even a bite, just weed and more weed.
Anybody on the Southern UK channel? Are you receiving over? They're receiving you over. Oh, excellent. Um, who's this over? Roger that. Uh, you got the mighty mouth over here at um, the southern coast over. Yeah, I'm on the. I'm at Celsius at the moment, doing a bit of fishing. Caught nothing at the moment. How about yourself? Yeah, one or two over this side over. Um, one or two little dabs and a uh, doggy rover. <laughs> Lucky you. Whereabouts are you fishing? I might come and join you over. Over. Well, that's a bit far for me to go for this time at the moment because the high tide is now. But thank you very much for the report. Okay, thank you very much. I hope I'll catch something soon. Enjoy your fishing, over. So, uh, enjoy your day. Over and out. Okay, take care. Out. Just to let everybody know, this is the radio. I was actually talking to somebody else in Portland in Dorset, and I'm in Selsey in West Sussex. It's an Android walkie-talkie. You don't have to use this. You can actually just download the Cello walkie-talkie tool, walkie-talkie app, get that right, onto your smartphone, and you can use your smartphone as the walkie-talkie. Anyway, it's up to you if you want to use it. There is sea fishing and coarse fishing channels to choose from in the UK. Well, this is what I'm having to deal with. Lots and lots of weed. Now I've got to clear this off. I'm getting caught up in the weed all the time. Update, midday. And I feel like I've entered the Eurovision Song Contest. Nilpua. It's not even a sight of a seagull in sight. And I'm on the ebb tide now. And I'm now playing. And I'll bring one rod in, change the baits over, give it some fresh bait. Okay, the uh, tide is now receding, as you can see. Just, I'm just going to walk along here. See my rods just to the left in the, on the foreground. It's now 1 p.m. I'm not going to give it much longer. I've had the odd bite, but nothing's taken. So I've not had any luck at all down here. I haven't. Tide's getting slack now, so I'm, what, what I might do, because it was very fast out there earlier, was taking my baits all the way along there. And you have to be careful, there's snags over there. Uh, so what I'm gonna do when, it looks like it's slack enough to cast a distance now. And uh, what I do, I do that.
I see it. it's gone 1.30 now, so I'm going to give it give it uh, quite a day now. Uh, sorry I couldn't catch a fish for you to see, but I shall be back. So please click like, subscribe uh, to my channel, and follow, and I'll see you all again soon.